Hello and welcome to our Minecraft gameplay video. Today we will be exploring a popular mod called Way of the Nether. This mod adds exciting new features and challenges. Let's begin. We're in and investigate the loud noise. Whoa, this looks like a nether portal. How did this get here? Please, go alert the mayor. We must figure out what's going on. By the way, this mod is for free in Minecraft Bedrock Edition. So, get ready for an exciting adventure into the depths of the nether. You're here! We're worried that something has happened to the mayor. Go see if you can find him upstairs. As you will see, this mod completely transforms the nether dimension, adding new binds, structures, and new creators. The first thing you'll notice is the weapons and armors available in the mod to defend yourself. With the right gear, you can take on even the thousands of nether creators. But the mod doesn't stop there. You'll also discover new structures like the nether ruins, the nether fortress, and soul towers. These structures are filled with new enemies like the nether knight, the blaze away, and the magma golem. The mayor must have gone through the portal. Place down the obsidian blocks and light it. We must find him. But now the real adventure begins by entering the strong nether portal. It looks like it's working again, but there's only one way to find out. So, let's go in. The next step is to explore the nether base camp. The nether base camp is essential for surviving in the nether. Great work on getting us all through the portal. The mayor has been spotted inside that castle over there. And the bridge has been destroyed by some strange flying creature. We've started reconstruction, but it's going to take a while to fix. Wait a minute. Is that him up there now? You'll never save your precious mayor. That's right. I'm using his body to store my soul. So you can't have him back now. Besides, I've grown quite fond of his hat. <laughs> Yoo-hoo! Friend! Over here! There's only one way we can help the mayor. We need to defeat the evil that controls him. First, we need to prepare and learn the way of the nether. There's no time to lose. We need to venture further in. Let's go! So let's follow him toward the Soul Sand Valley Vine. This terrifying biome is Soul Sand Valley. Don't let the horror stop you, though. There's an unusual amount of ancient debris here. We will need ancient debris to start crafting the strongest armor in all of Minecraft. Take this pickaxe and collect eight pieces of ancient debris. Return to me once you're done. You need a safe place to store your items and craft new items in the nether. Good job! That should be enough. Now... Let's get going! Oh no! This looks like the remains of a ghast attack. Thankfully, it seems whoever lived here got out just in time. Quick, smelt the ancient debris to create netherite scraps. And let's keep moving. We don't know if that ghast is still around. Hurry! Brilliant work! Now, let's go! It's not a good idea to stay in one place for too long in the nether. But nether isn't just a place to grind for experience. It's also home to unique materials, to craft weapons and armors that are stronger than diamonds. Uh, uh, what was that? I just had a great idea. You go on ahead without me while I take some important notes. I hope you enjoyed watching it as much I enjoyed playing it. If you haven't already, be sure to give this mod a try and let me know what you think in the comments. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next part of this incredible mod.